a smart IP camera with battery, 6,000 milliamps, 720 HD, 130 view angle, and 100% wireless. How are we doing everyone? This is Dario from MediaBox ENT Lab. If this is the first time on the channel, make sure you subscribe. Let me know what you think of the product, leave a comment, and appreciate it a like. All the information on this product will be right below the video. So let's look at Mascari version 3 HD 720 and it can last up to six months with one charge. So if you're looking for a nice portable camera, I think this is one will do it. Plus the battery is one, one amazing thing. I mean, up to six months, depends on the traffic too, and one charge. So let's see what we get. So we get the Mascari camera version three. So nice looking camera. It feels pretty heavy. I think I have to, I have to say almost weigh like a pound. You can even use a tripod right over here. 130 angle view. We can see the speaker around the back. This is the magnetic, I'll show you how that works. This is the cover in the back. So what we get here is the power reset bunch, uh, micro USD for charge, and also up to 128 gig in a micro SD card. So you can put a micro SD card, and when it's a move, it automatically will record into the camera besides sending your information on your cell phone. Let's see what else we get into the box. So we get the cable to charge the camera, the instructions, a quick guide. They are pretty simple to follow. Remember, if you have an iPhone, you scan here. And if you got an Android phone, you scan right over here. You download the application. You need to register with the application. When you register, then you can add the camera. This, if you like to hold it around the wall, we had this small pin to reset the camera and the screws. We get some uh, warranty card, tense card. And we get the 3M, there is two ways to install it. Like I said before, you can we can just put it right in the hole. Or they have the 3M, we can stick down the wall, this one this side, and then you stick this in the wall. And the way it works is magnetic. And it has a lot of power. What's this? See that? So now you just put this right in the wall, and then you can set the direction this way, up, down. Alright, so let's at the camera, it's pretty simple to do that. So I wanna, it'll be one of my best cameras right now. So to do this, the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna download that application we already did, it's called uh, Cloud Edge. We load the application, I already registered the application. So at this point, we're gonna add the camera. So we click plus. So now we need to turn the camera on Actually, the camera is on. In case the camera is on sleep mode, press button right in the back and it turns on. And let me see if I can show you. It's a real dot right at the corner. And maybe it's hard to see it, but it's right there. It's blinking. So that means that's the time. So then right over here, we get the application that shows camera, doorbell. They got camera and I use battery camera. So you press battery camera. I see if it is asleep. And it lets you know the Turn the power on. I agree to the message. Click Please next. Reset the device by holding the reset button for five seconds. If you want to reset it, we don't have to reset it. It's already red. I agree to the message. The battery camera button and tap it's on already. So at this point, when I ask you to enter your password, you're gonna set. You're gonna you put the Wi-Fi. It will be your local Wi-Fi, 2.4 gigahertz. And then the next, you're going to put the password of your network. That way, the camera gets mapped into the network and it's done. Uh, all cameras require 2.4. Any smart devices today. So we're going to click next. Please remove the protective film from your camera lens. We did Check that. Next to show your QR code. We do next. I put the camera pretty fast. Listen to the noise. I'm going to put it both together. We are ready. Connecting. Please 
wait a moment. We say connecting, and now we wait. I find the device already, I see the first green line. That's it. So at this point, we can rename it if we want. We can click here and put a different name. We click done. And you see already a thumbnail. Already we have thumbnail right in the ceiling. Right over here, we get the devices. If you got more devices, more camera messages, uh, friends, if you like to share in me, they register. So this is the camera number. We can call whatever we want. We click right over here. Okay. 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 Oh, let me okay. It's already sending feedback because the phone is too close to the camera. But we already get video. We want to put that HD. And we want. We can see right there. See? It says nice, nice HD portable camera. Right in the top, we get the time, the day. We show you how much battery we have left. It's full. Let's press again. Right over here, we can record. We press record. We take a screenshot. We can talk to the camera and we can turn it off and on the speaker. I'm going to go back. One second. From here, we can a screenshot. If I press that, already took a screenshot. If I press record, let's pay attention there. It's recording. It will be recording the camera too. And right now it is body detection. You can turn it off on, turn it on. I'm going to leave it off. And history, it came in the history here. No SD card. I didn't put any SD card yet. It will let you know this card. It will tell you the time so you can move back and forward and see what's going on. And you can see a screenshot recorded in the calendar. If I go back into the camera again, we can go to the configuration right there. So in those three that you click right there. And here we can turn off the notification. We can share to a friend, we can get information on the network, information on the SD card, we can rotation view and body detection is off right now. We can set the speaker to 70%. We want to talk to the camera volume, power management, and the version I just updated to the latest version. That's nice to keep updating. That's simple. It's a simple way to hook the camera and even you get a bit rate and even the Wi-Fi connection between the camera and the router is about 95% depending on your location. Now, definitely the Mascari 3A is a wireless camera 100% and one thing I like about this is the battery, the battery life. Now, if you don't need to worry about it and if you have any plug closed, sure, you can plug this and leave it plug all the time. So let me know in the comment what you like it more about this camera. I think it's great. For me, I said the battery resolution, and it took me, what? Well, we did this almost real time in the video. It was real fast to connect it, and it's done. Download the application, put it in. Simple. Thank you very much, and I'll see you in the next video.